Hey guys, this is John from TheTechnoCog.com once again. Today I have a look at the newly released Harry Potter 3D Blu-ray of The Deathly Hallows Part 2. And now, as you may know, the 3D version is exclusive to Best Buy. And they also have Part 1 in 3D right now as well. Now the regular version is on sale for $19.99 at Best Buy, and this one was just $22.99. So for a few bucks more, you get everything you would have got plus a 3D movie. I think that's just a great deal for uh, future-proofing yourself, or you might have a 3D TV, so that can work out. And some people will actually buy just the 3D disc, so you might be able to sell it for 10 bucks or something on eBay and effectively play about 12 bucks for your movie, which isn't a bad deal. As you see, you get the 3D, the Blu-ray, the DVD, and the digital copy, which... I believe the Best Buy one comes with a streaming copy, so this may or may not be a good deal in that way. I don't know how it works with iPads and iPhones, but uh, I don't really use those anyway, so no problem. The 3D also has a lenticular cover. It's sort of hard to, hard to see, but you can see some depth there, which isn't too bad. But it's obviously branded 3D. Cover art is exactly the same as the uh, box art here, where you're standing on most releases, really. Open it up. You have your copy info. Nothing special. Just 3D movie. Your regular Blu ray, your DVD, and of course, special features. It's a lot of stuff for 23 bucks. It's not bad for a new release. I'm going to go ahead and pick this up as soon as possible because if Best Buy repeats what they normally do, once this is off sale, it'll be about $30, $35 for the 3D version. So you'll end up paying a good chunk of change more. But as of right now, like I said, you can get it for just like 4 bucks more, which isn't bad. So they got this and the Part 1. It's the only place that has a 3D right now. So uh, you might want to check that out, guys. All right, have a good one.